Hi everyone, John Garrett here from hypertransitory.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to um, uh, add a template, a different template to each page in your Joomla 1.5 website. Uh, assuming you would want to do that, you can add uh, a template, uh, you can have different templates for each menu item in your entire Joomla site. So if you had 20 templates, you could you know, use 20 different templates in your website. I doubt you'd want to do that, but um, right now I'll just show you. I've got a default Joomla install here, and this is the, the default Milky Way template that you will see after installing Joomla. And so uh, let's just kind of go through the pages. We can see that every page is using this template. It's pretty consistent, but we're going to change that. So uh, let's go to our back end here, and you can see that uh, I'm at my template manager. Um, if I uh, wanted to get to there, I go to extensions, template manager. That's going to bring me here. And we can see there's quite a few templates installed. Here's our default. This one is set at default. Um, let's start from the top here and go to uh, bees. Now you can see there's a list of items here and it's menu selection. Unfortunately, you can only assign it to uh, a menu item. It can't be assigned to an article. It has to be assigned to a menu item. So uh, you got to work within that little frame there. But what we can do is here's our top menu and we'll choose about Joomla. And as you can see, that's here in the top menu. So we're going to choose that one and we're going to save it. That's really all there is to it. Um, I'm going to go down to JA Purity and I'm going to tell it select from list scroll down and find that menu that I want get the menu item I want I got features there go down to JS Jamba scroll down news let's save that and JS relevant it's one of my favorite templates is relevant from uh, Joomla Shack anyway uh, the community we're gonna save that one so now you can see each one of these templates is assigned got a check mark in that column there so it's assigned to at least one menu item and um, you know here here's an unfortunate thing is when you go to articles you'd like oh I'd like to assign it to Joomla overview well you can't do that it has to be a menu item so that article has to be you know assigned to a menu and then you can assign it to the menu so this is what we got now let's go back to the front end of our site which is here let's go uh, back to the home page and let's click on about Joomla and now we've got that template for about Joomla and not all of these templates have a top menu but we'll go here to the features that's changed again um, let's go back to our index and go to news yet another template and finally the community alright so each one of those uh, menu items is now assigned a different template and you can do that, you know, over and over. And you know, if you need a slightly different um, feature or look to a page, you can go ahead and um, go ahead and assign a different template. And you can adjust the CSS and adjust the styling on that one, and um, that will uh, let you, you know, adjust the look of your page, you know, in a fairly simple way. That uh, is actually pretty powerful too. So. Just keep that in mind that that's all it takes is, is, as long as you remember it's got to be a menu item sometimes uh, if you forget and you're you go through and it's like why isn't this working well you know you got to have a menu item for it first I mean it would be great if you could just assign it to whatever you want but but uh, that's usually good enough sometimes what you can do if you need you need an article and um, you know you just don't have anywhere where you can put it you can go to a, a menu or go to a menu that isn't showing or even create a new menu and just create one create a menu item assign your article to it and even if it's not showing anywhere you can still then go back to your template and choose it uh, in here it will still show up here that's all Joomla needs so at that point you should be good to go um, so that's that. It's very, very simple, very short, very simple. And um, just let me know if you have any questions on that. And uh, thanks for watching.